there's so many people I've been talking to lately that just will not make a freaking sale. You know, it's like they just, they're just delaying on it. They're just delaying on it. They're just avoiding it. I talked to this guy today. He, you know, quit his job recently and he, you know, he had 50 people that he knew that were small business owners that would be a great fit for his service. And he just, he just, you know, couldn't do it. And, and you know, part of him sort of told himself that, oh, I'm not afraid of this or I'm, I'm not scared of it or whatever. And I said, all right, fine. Are you sitting in front of your computer? Yes, okay. Pull up your email, okay? Make a new message. Who's the first person that comes to your mind? Put their email address in, in the subject line, push catching up, then put in their name, then put in, hey, uh, you know, name. Um, would love to get together and have a cup of coffee or ha t talk on the phone later this week or whatever it was, right? Talk soon. Sign. Send. Done. It's just completely done at that point. Like, but it's amazing because, you know, so many times people want to get, you know, a client or they want to get new business or whatever, and they know all these people, but they just never really reach out to them. And it's like, dude, at, at a certain point, you got to think, how do I make a sale today? Just right now, right now, how do I get business? How do I get somebody to work with me right now before the end of the day? You know, we did some of that, uh, you know, today, some stuff that we've been trying to roll out for a while or we've been thinking about rolling out for a while. And you know, you just contemplate it over and over. You just think, oh, should I do this? Should I do that? Bup, 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 bup. And it, eventually you just gotta do it. You just gotta put it out. It's gonna be scrappy. It doesn't need to look good. Probably the best things I've ever sold in my life look terrible. They didn't look good. They didn't have the fancy, the dumbest thing that I ever sold were like, or the things that are the least successful were the most pretty ones with the, with the nice website and the nice proposal and the, and the nice sort of, you know, cover letter and all that, all that kind of crap. That stuff just never really works. The best stuff is the stuff that's just so valuable that even though it looks like trash and it doesn't look great, it's just, it sells anyway. You know, people are interested in it or maybe there isn't even any visual. There's just a conversation and you just say, yeah, well, if you want me to help you out, it's gonna be this amount of money. And the person just goes for it. If you need all the sort of look good, good logo, good website, good proposal and all that, if you need all that, it's probably not that valuable. Say hi to Amanda there. Yeah, it, it's probably not that valuable if you need all that crap. So. If you if you've been thinking about you know growing or ta you know taking things to the next level, making the business happen, like literally, you know, I'm shooting this video. It's what is it, 7:52 p.m. You know, what could you do first thing tomorrow morning? Just come out of the gate storming. I told the guy, I said, look, you sent one email, send ten more today. Right? It was like 4 p.m. And then tomorrow, send ten more. And then the next day, send ten more. And then after that, start reaching out to people you don't even know. And if you do that and you just keep reaching out to people that you don't know, I mean, there's literally no way to lose. I think people don't really understand how it works. Like, you know, whenever you're first starting out in business, and to be honest, it doesn't matter what you're selling. I mean, even if you're selling a piece of software, you still need customers. You still need human beings. I mean, you know, so you gotta get human being to talk to you. So find human being, talk to human being, you know, get human being to see the value of what you're doing, whether that's from, you know, telling them a story or generally from asking them a bunch of questions and then get that human being to commit and pay. And that's what it is. I mean, that's like 80% of what you should be thinking about when you're just getting started. But it's the one thing that nobody wants to do. Everybody wants to, oh, they want to work on their product. They want to get better at their services, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, that one little thing, as painful as it is, as annoying as it is, you might say, oh, I don't want to be a salesperson or whatever, but do you want revenue? Everybody needs revenue. So nobody focuses on it, nobody likes to do it, but it's that simple. And it almost sounds so simple that it can't be that, it's gotta be something else, it's gotta be something more interesting, but it's not. It's sort of the rugged, simple stuff that actually crushes it in the end. So look, I hope that that helps, and if any of you guys have been sitting on the sidelines waiting to make something happen and you think you have to prepare and wait and wait and oh, and this and that and the other, just do it, just freaking do it tonight. You can send an email, I'd rather you send an email at 7.53 p.m. than wait another damn day. So, you know, get on it and keep crushing out there and we'll talk soon.